Hello friends, so this is part one of the Docker series. Docker installing Oracle 19C in, uh, in Docker. So this is this website that you're looking at is uh, maintained by Oracle Corporation. And uh, they have been putting Git images, uh, 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 Docker scripts for, uh, for Oracle databases. And as you see that they have all the way to 19.3. And they also have uh, uh, the one for patching. So let me see, where is it for patching? Let's see, Oracle database, single instance, and samples, all right. So I have taken Docker uh, uh, scripts from Oracle and I have uh, modified it to make it easier for my work. And that's what I'm sharing with you. So let me go to my terminal. Uh, uh, before I do that, I have been keeping all my scripts at uh, this location. So go to Oracle this site and you will find that uh, this is the these are the scripts i'll be using today for part one of this presentation so the scripts are here and uh, uh, the building of the image depends upon these files so like linux x uh, 64 19300 this is the zip file that you can download from uh, Oracle's website. So to keep it small, I have just put a placeholder dot download. Similarly, if you go, uh, if you go to uh, other, if you go to other folders, you will find the references here. Okay. So now let me hide this one and okay so I have placed my docker scripts in this uh, directory and uh, over here so let me give you a walkthrough of how I have arranged uh, uh, where the files are following following uh, Oracle's uh, convention. So this is where I have placed the zip file from Oracle installation and this is the docker file. So you see here that it takes Oracle 7 as the base and uh, and then goes through the rest of the steps so i will run the docker build let me go to okay better here so minus v 19 minus c and minus v is basically name of the uh, folder so So it's building the image and it will take uh, like five or six minutes. So I'll pause this video and I'll come back when the image is built. So it is done and now we have uh, this uh, image and before we patch it, let me show you uh, the version of Oracle in that. So let me get the name of the image. So I will run a bash uh, uh, command prompt in the in that image. It's a very useful uh, 
way to explore internals of an image. So now I am inside the image. So, so you see here that SQL Plus is version 19.3. So now we'll go to the next stage and we will patch it. So let me walk you through the folder. So this is where uh, uh, I have taken Oracle's script, build patch Docker images and the Docker file itself is here. So you see the base image is this one that we just built for Oracle 19.3 and uh, this requires this uh, uh, Oracle patch, uh, Oracle O patch software because uh, the one that comes with 19.3 is version, version 17 and you need version 23. And the patch file, the latest patch file, I have placed it here. So with this, let's patch. And uh, this is Oracle's command. So this will again take uh, a few minutes. I will pause the recording and come back to it when it's done. Patching is finished. And uh, you see that now we have a new uh, image. So we will check the Oracle version in this image. So I run the command for first getting into bash shelf in the image. So I am in the image and uh, I run SQL plus and you see here, this is 19.9. .9. So in this uh, process, we were able to create a base image of 19.3 and then apply the patch. Thank you. So our uh, the next video is how to use uh, this uh, image.